Welcome to the 2015 Sarasota Film Festival. Thank you. So tell me a little bit about your film and you know, introduce yourself just so audiences can know. Cool. Uh, I'm Ray Bouchard. Uh, the film is Apalachicola and I play the dad in the film. Uh, it's a story about a, a girl who's getting out of the army and she has a civilian job now and she's gonna stop at home and see dad and little brother to just check in and uh, finds out dad is sicker than she thought. He has COPD and uh, he's an oysterman and the brother helps him on the boat and is really frustrated because he has an offer to go work on an oil rig for 3,000 a week and sister wants to put dad in the nursing home and there's a struggle between the two and uh, it's a very beautifully filmed, a lot of landscape and um, uh, out on the water actually a lot of the time. Perfect for Sarasota. It's wonderful, yeah. And uh, and it's it's a beautiful film. It's a great story. The girl has to make some pretty powerful decisions for herself and for her family. And it has a very sweet ending. I'll say and that. How did you find the role? I was contacted by the director uh, via his casting person asking if I would like to audition for it. He'd seen me in other work. Uh, some friends of his had uh, worked with me on other films. And uh, I auditioned the, the night that I got the request. They sent me a, a script. And basically they just wanted to talk to me and see what my tone was and um, that was basically the interview. And do you have any, you know, in playing the role, were there any personal ties or what did you bring to the role? Yeah, a lot. I'm a fifth generation Floridian. I grew up on the water. I actually fished the middle grounds a little bit when I was younger. My dad went out there every summer with his father who was uh, a fisherman and uh, have a great regard for the, the landscape, the water, uh, the whole state. Everything is just so beautiful to me. And this focuses a lot on the beauty of the Apalachicola area and uh, also mostly what's happening with the people and the families that are hurting because of the loss of the industry, of the oyster industry and so forth. It's, uh, it's a beautiful film, but yeah, I have a lot of ties and very very do connected like to the characters. I do, I love them. <laughs> Is that, was that a requirement in the film? We did, uh, uh, yeah, I'm coming up if you give me a bushel of oysters. But uh, yeah, the, the guy who owned the boat that we worked with, uh, he was from an old family as well. Very interesting to meet him and see his life on the water. And uh, he supplied us with the best oysters I'd ever had. And I grew up on Appalachia oysters. When I was a kid, we would go up to North Florida and we'd stop at Crystal River and get a bushel for $5. And they were huge back in the old days, you know, so. Matt, how things have changed. Yeah. And so tell us for, you know, audiences who might not be able to make the screenings, is there anywhere they can find more information about the film? Sure, go to uh, Appalachicola, that's with one P, uh, on Facebook. And uh, you can Google it as well. It'll probably come up on IMDb. Uh, hopefully, there's. It's it's not actually uh, viewable because it's still in the festival circuit right now. But um, there's a trailer on there, and uh, also if you contact the director John Francis, uh, you could probably work out some kind of an arrangement. I'm sure he'd love people to see the film. And have you been to the festival before? I have. I've been coming to Sarasota okay. since it started. Love it. <laughs> I grew up in Clearwater, and uh, I, I love this festival. It's really wonderful. Great people here, and you guys do a wonderful job. I mean, you treat everybody like old. Well, we're glad you're back. Thanks.